back to Pure Power Panda. Today I have my November favorites for you guys because November is over and of course this month I tested lots of new products and things and I want to share all of them with you today. So I wish you lots of fun watching. Let's get started with my first favorite which has been my cranberry and coconut smoothie recipe. I think this smoothie turned out so delicious. So of course I had it several times throughout the month and it's actually very very simple. It only contains coconut milk, cranberries, a banana, soy milk and if you like you can add um, some type of protein powder. I usually use pea protein powder. I think the result tastes like a milkshake. The color is awesome thanks to the cranberries. It's super delicious and um, I think it's perfect for the season because right now it's kind of easy to get cranberries. Another one of my favorites has been the H&M campaign for their winter collection. I don't know if it's the same campaign throughout the world but I'm assuming it is. And on this campaign there is Katy Perry and I really love the fact that they chose Katy Perry. Not just because she's a great artist but also because of the um, role model she is in the sense of her body shape. Because very often you see these very slim and super skinny models presenting these clothes. But this time they chose Katy Perry who of course has a very um, toned body. She has muscles. You can see she has muscles in her legs because obviously she's a performer. She dances a lot. And I like the fact that they chose like a woman with a womanly figure. And I really wish that more um, companies and stores and brands would do that. Something I also really like this month has been the Flipboard app. This app has been on my phone since, ever since I got it because it's pre-installed. But I never used it and I never really got the whole point of using Flipboard. Um, if you don't know what Flipboard Flipboard is, Flipboard is basically like your own magazine, so you just select um, the types of news you're interested in, so it can be just news in general or maybe um I don't know, arts and um, cooking or whatever you're interested in. So you choose the different topics and then you can just flip through the magazine and see all of the news releases from the categories you pick. I think this app is super practical because you see like all of the news like right away. I like the whole layout and the design and how you can just flip through everything. And it's also a great way to see news from different news outlets. So you're not just seeing one point of view and it's a great way to stay up to date with what's going on in the world or with whatever category you are interested in. One of my favorite drinks this month has actually been mint tea. I don't know why. I used to never drink mint tea but now I'm loving it. I drink it every day. It's like my go-to drink now because in the winter time I don't enjoy drinking water that much because it's just too cold and I like something warm. In my last favorites video I actually showed you guys um, a detox tea by Fin Tea and I said it's with mint and one of you guys actually wrote below the video that the appetite suppressing um, effect comes from the peppermint so she said like there's really no point in getting a detox tea you can just get a mint tea and it will have the same effect I can't say that's true I don't feel an appetite suppressing effect with just peppermint tea um, but I still like it and of course I'm not drinking it for that reason I'm actually drinking it just for the flavor next up are my favorite movies and yes you heard me right because this month I actually picked two movies for you guys from two different genres and the first one is um, Harry and the Hendersons. That's what it's called in English. In German they called it Bigfoot and the Hendersons. I'm sure a lot of you guys know this movie. It's from the 80s and it's about this family that travels into the woods and they meet Bigfoot and they bring him home and then they start living with Bigfoot and it's actually a very funny movie. It's one of those movies with an awesome atmosphere and this really lovable family. It's funny and it's really a great comedy to watch for the whole family and especially around this time of year because I feel like in, during Christmas or like during the Christmas season. It's so much more fun to watch movies like that. I can definitely recommend it if you want to have a good laugh, if you want to see something nice and feel really good and warm in your heart. So next up is a horror movie and that's of course um, not something to feel good in your heart about. <laughs> this one is um, Your Next. It's from the year 2014. It's about this rich family that has a get-together to celebrate their parents um, anniversary and they invited their kids um, including all of the kids partners or significant others and yeah suddenly everything goes wrong and people are being killed and I'm not gonna go too much into detail about the story because um, there are a few plot twists in this and um, which makes it awesome so yeah I can definitely recommend it if you're looking for a thrilling horror movie with a lot of gore. <laughs> now 
now let's move on to something lighter which is this uh, jelly or marmalade by the British brand Ch Chivers I don't know how you say it but it's actually a jelly marmalade with lemon and I feel like this flavor is very hard to find sometimes I got it in the German supermarket Edeka and I just love anything that tastes sour and this one definitely tastes sour so if you love sour flavors like me you definitely have to try this one out and I'm sure you can get this um, in a lot of places because it's a British brand and if they sell it here in Germany in a supermarket you can probably get it all over the place. If you watch a lot of my favorites videos you know that usually I show you what I bought from Fatletics this month because I'm signed up with them so and I'm also a brand ambassador so every month I will show you like my favorite picks and this month I actually ordered this um, jumper or sweatshirt whatever you want to call it wherever you are from. I think it's really cool that now they're not just making like fitness uh, clothes and like gym wear but also regular stuff and I picked up this one this month because I thought it's so neat um, I love the cut on it because it's very short and it has this nice detail here on the sleeve with a button and here on the side you see Fabletics logo and another zipper I really love the color I love anything gray especially when it comes to clothes I just love wear wearing gray because I think it goes with everything and this is just so comfortable and so cute like the only downside to it is that when you get it fresh from its plastic like when you take it out from the plastic it smells horrible it smells so chemical so you will definitely have to wash this before you wear it the first time um, if you're interested in this one I don't remember what it's called but I'm gonna link everything down in the description box of the video and of course one of my favorites this month has been my file effects which is the domino patent in the a5 size November was definitely file effects month on my channel because first of I showed you how I did this makeover for my file effects to get it looking how it looks so there's marble on the outside and copper and then I also filmed my file effects setup video for 2016 so I spent a lot of time with my file effects this month and I've really been enjoying it I'm happy with the result I think it looks awesome so my file effects is definitely my favorite for this month when it comes to music my favorite artist has been Rob Zombie this month and I've been listening to the album uh, Hellbilly Deluxe and my favorite songs this month were um, Dracula and Demonoid Phenomenon I think that's what it's called like even though this is metal music I really enjoy it and I think it's awesome to listen to when you're doing your workouts when you're at the gym if you're running whatever I think that's a great time to listen to metal and yeah I've been listening to it again so many times I'm, ki I'm kind of sick of it now but that happens to me all the time so that's just normal for me but I also found really interesting this month was a study from the year 2002 through the year 2007 and in this study they looked at the diet of around 70,000 people who are all vegetarians or vegans and they compared it to regular meat eater diets to find out whether vegan or vegetarian diets are protein deficient and of course they discovered that they're definitely not protein deficient they actually get the same amount of protein in their diet just like meat eaters and I thought this is so super interesting because so many people claim that when you eat a vegetarian or vegan diet you're not getting enough protein because so many people assume that protein only comes from animal products and that is definitely not the case and if you're interested in this I will link my blog post um, down below there's also a link to the study and in this blog post I also linked a very interesting YouTube video that kind of talks about the whole thing yeah and finally my last favorite is probably everybody's favorite and that's the toffee nut latte from Star Starbucks. I love this coffee and of course I don't get it with whipped cream and I just get it with a soy milk and before everybody freaks out yes the toffee nut latte is actually vegan. I wasn't sure so I, I googled it several times and it was so hard to find accurate information on this because Starbucks changes their recipes and their ingredients all the time but I actually found a blog by a British girl that works in a Starbucks and she made a list of all of the things vegans can have at Starbucks and it's very um, recent it's from November I think and in there she wrote that the toffee nut latte is vegan so that made me very very happy and maybe it makes you happy too because this one is actually one of their best coffees I don't go a lot to Starbucks but in the winter time I go all the time because I love 
the toffee nut latte. So these were all of my November favorites. I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, it would be awesome if you could give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Thank you very much for watching. I wish you a wonderful Christmas season and I'll see you in my next video. I'm walking around feeling free Thinking about what's happened to me from July Up till now Don't know where Don't know how Lately I've come to read